Hi there. Uh, a few weeks ago I introduced you to what I thought might be a solution to make the Lumix GM1 uh, pocketable and I showed you the um, the Olympus uh, body cap lens 15 millimeter uh, f8.0. Uh, I've been trying it a little bit and as in terms of size or form factor it definitely uh, performed as expected in terms of image quality it, it's uh, my feelings are kind of ambiguous the lumix has a great image quality you may want to have a look at the test i did uh, a few days ago uh, comparing it to the uh, sony rx100 mark iii uh, which is considered to be uh, in terms of image quality and lens quality and everything a, a definitely a high performer in the in the compact size uh, area and the Lumix in my perspective was the winner in that competition so we're having a camera with a great sensor um, with great quality great image processor and a, a nice system camera and we're fitting it with a lens that is definitely a, a cheap lens it's not a quality lens what I've been doing is I switch the camera to the art filters um, you have this option I like to always still do a, a raw file to save a raw file but uh, I tried with this art filter setting and um, I l would like you to have a look at it and judge for yourself. Uh, I think that for what they are, they're nice pictures. I mean, they, they can be used, but it's kind of reducing this definitely good camera to the level more or less of a, of a smartphone camera. And I'm not sure if that is what this thing <laughs> deserves because it's definitely a great camera. I still have to figure out the, the, good, the perfect use for it because as I told you and I, I want to show you again, with this, with this uh, lens on or body cap lens, it's, it's very small. But once you put on uh, like the kit lens, the kit zoom lens, it becomes uh, definitely not pocketable anymore because you put it on here and the camera becomes too large to put in a pocket. So the idea is what is this camera good for and uh, is this thing, uh, because calling it a lens is this, this body cap with uh, an optical element in, or three optical elements inside, is this the solution to the question of making this pocketable? Uh, I will show you some sample pictures after this. I will not comment them. You will see sample pictures uh, just taken with this out of camera with the art filters. And then I will, in the end, and they're marked as such, uh, I will put in some, uh, actually two um, images converted from raw image, one in black and white and one in color to give you an impression of what is possible. But even if it's not really possible to show that on YouTube because of the image quality or the resolution, I can tell you they might look decently good uh, in, in, on the screen now, on the, on the PC screen now, but if you put them in Lightroom and you have a look at it, you will see that they're not perfectly sharp. They're not really, really good enough. And I would, I have mixed feelings about recommending this or not. It might be an emergency solution if you want to carry this thing around as a system and you want to have this one on so you can take a quick shot if you need, but keep your lenses like this, like this, the kit lens, or even like this is the 20 millimeter 1.7, a great, great lens, a fantastic lens. Um, carry them along in another pocket and change when you want to do something serious and just use this as a quick emergency solution. That's probably the use I'm going to make of it. Uh, leave it up to you to judge. Um, have a look at the pictures and you will understand what I mean. Thank you very much and see you back here soon.